Hey guys, Savage Crom here, and welcome to It's My Life, episode 2, um, Worst Dream, and this idea has been suggested to me by the Tedward01, um, he's a good friend of mine, and um, I just talked to him, like asking him what he'd like to hear, and he said, um, Worst Dream. So, um, before I get into the story, this is the gameplay I have, which is a plus 4 to kill ACR um, like gameplay on Doom. Uh, there's a few good bits in this, like Reapers, a Pavlo, and stuff like that. So, um, I'm playing with Zodiac for, for the win. Uh, Zodiac VG is his game tag, um, by the way. So, um, if you're interested, you know, uh, add us on Xbox Live. Our game tags will be in the description. Um, but, uh, without further ado, let's get into the story. So, when I was thinking of doing the worst dream, uh, at first I was thinking of bad dreams, like scary things, like... That's automatically what you think if you think of a, the, the, your worst dream. But then I thought, like, it's not necessarily, um, like, scary as in, like, appearance, like, looking. It's uh, just kind of uh, taking something I enjoy and kind of, like, twisting it a bit. Um, so, um, basically, I'm going to start off by saying I've always wanted to go skydiving. I don't know why... Um, it's one of those things that I I've wanted to do. I'm not an adrenaline junkie or anything like that. I've just I've always wanted to like uh, do something like like that because I, th I feel like it'd be a good experience and it'd be really fun. And you know, not many people like uh, it's not something like you do every day basically. So um, I started off the dream by basically being in my house, being all normal, and then I was all I was almost like transported to like another. I would say world, like somewhere else. Now, I didn't know where I was. I didn't know, you know, what my family was or anything. Because at the time, I was like sitting down in my... S this is in the dream, by the way. I'm not actually transported in real life. Anyway, yeah. So, um, I didn't know where anybody was. I just found myself in this room. There was like machinery all around me. So, um, I felt like I needed to uh, kind of like look around. So, I was walking around. And, and I saw this like big like centerpiece, if you will. It's like a dome. Like this bit uh coincidence we're playing on dome it was like a dome like in the middle of dome like that but on a smaller scale and there was like screens all around it and uh there were like videos of people or like live like feeds of people I didn't know exactly what was going on so i um i uh crowding around the screen and so i went over there and i was like oh what's happening and um basically they said that they were watching people doing skydiving and so i assumed there's like tons of different things like on different screens and um like skydiver just one of them so i thought oh i've always wanted to go skydiver maybe i could have a go so i said um what is there any because it was a dream you know what's the worst that could happen so um the first thing i did was go um like to like the centerpiece and like ask the like, people around there. i was like oh could i have a go at skydiver please so um so first of all they said okay we need to get you suited up um go over there and you'll get like a suit put on you and um, all your safety gear and everything and then we'll go on to step two. So I did all that and then um, they said, okay, stand on this little pod please. So I stood on it and I got transported into this plane. Now, um, if any of you know, like basically if you've watched people go skydiving or things like that, you'll know that you start off having all the like talks that you're going to be fine and things like that. And then uh, they say, okay, right, I want to need you to jump and um, you're going to jump either with an instructor or if you're like... Um, you know, you're gonna, you've experienced, you're gonna uh, go by yourself. So, um, they were like, okay, right, I'm gonna count down f um, from three to one, and on number one, I want you to, you know, go and um, jump, basically. So, I was like, okay, right, this is gonna be good. So, I looked down out of the plane before I jumped, I could see there was a big dome in the middle, and I was like, oh, that looks like the one which is, um, which is the centerpiece and basically there was a hole in it and they were like okay you aim for that hole basically you need to fall down fly and then when you go through that hole there's going to be a soft landing for you when you get into that soft landing um you're going to bounce off and um you're going to be fine so the instructor counted down and we were off now first thing you want to know about skydiving is uh, don't do it when you're in a dream okay something bad's always going to happen because in a dream, you know, you can dream about uh, flying and things like that, and it can be awesome. Skydiving's not so fun. 
So let me tell you what I mean. So I was falling, I was falling down, I was skydiving down, trying to get into this hole. And everything was going well, I was lined up right, they said I was doing really well. And then suddenly someone hit me like that, really hard. And I was like, ah, what was that? There was a bird hit me. And I went off course. And just as I was going to hit, like, go through the middle of the hole, I went off course and I hit the side. I I don't know why, because it was a dream, but I felt the most like the worst pain in my side cause I hit on the side I went down the side of the dome thing and just landed on the floor now um th I thought oh this can't get any worse you know I'm hurting in a dream for some reason it's really painful and um you know I'm at the bottom of I'm in the like middle of nowhere next to a dome and uh, no one's there to help me so like I see like this thing come up and it says Ethan you failed and I'm like what what is this and then I see my own dad in the corner laughing at me like ha 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 you failed you failed and I'm just like oh this is the worst thing ever so I get teleported back for some reason I haven't got any broken bones or anything even though it felt like it couldn't move at all um but I was perfectly fine and then I saw my dad and I was watching the screen and he was doing exactly the same thing as I did and I was watching him go on to the um like from the plane and jumping down and and he did it without any problems no birds hit him he fell into the dome bounced like from the like secure thing at the bottom and just got teleported back now i was thinking okay um if you're gonna show off like that you know i've got to do it again i've got to do it again. much better this time so this time i i went down again and i could see um that there was birds flying past so i thought okay Nick, this time i jump i've got to be careful so he said uh, three to one again and i jumped now um, i saw the birds i dodged them like i would anyway uh, so i got I, w I was there right about to go in the middle of the dome and i just felt a tug on my back and i was like oh what was that and i turned around like sort of in midair like like in slow motion like really cool and it was my dad holding on to my back and he took all my safety gear off so so and he and he put on a parachute and he floated to safety and then he got teleported back. I don't know why he did this because he was my dad but oh well. Um, I fell onto the safety bit which he was supposed to do and bounce off but because I didn't have any safety gear I just hit the floor for some reason I just hit the safety thing and um, basically they didn't teleport me back so um, I was just kind of stuck there couldn't move and I woke up and I th well I thought I woke up and I couldn't see anything, it was really dark in my room and things like that and I, I was finding it hard to breathe so I turned the light on and there was my dad and he was holding this like device type thing and he pressed it, we both got teleported back into the room and um, he said let's do it again and he took me up there and he pushed me out of the plane and we were falling like through um, like down down going into the hole and just when we got to the hole he pushed me to the left I fell down the side like I did the first time he fell through he bounced out he went ha ha and laughed at me again for some strange reason and um, I was just there kind of on the floor uh, and I couldn't see what I was doing uh, I, all my eyes were, like hazy I couldn't feel any part of my body whatsoever and um, that wasn't really the best experience I woke up after that and yeah Everything was like, I couldn't really, do you know when you have dreams, you can't really exactly remember what happens sometimes until like, um, I don't know, I just, I couldn't really remember what was happening and like, I was kind of like scared because my dad isn't usually that mean to me and I'm just like, well, you know, I might need help. I mean, dreams like that, um, you usually have like dreams about things when you have um, talked about it or done something previous that day or the day before what's uh, like maybe you've dreamt about flying and the day before you've dreamt about like you, you've talked about like birds and um, how great it could be if you could fly and stuff like that um sometimes though if you're talking about uh, scary things like a horror story or a horror movie or something like that uh, you go to sleep like i do and you dream things about you know mass murderers and uh, people kidnapping you and then chloroforming you and then and then, yeah, other things like that. I'm not going to go into detail. <laughs> but um, anyway, um, thanks for uh, listening to my worst dream. I think this is a pretty good idea by my um, my friend, the Tedward01, I think it is. Um, I'll try to put his uh, like game tag in the description. Um, he hasn't got any videos up, but if you subscribe, he might put some up. So do that. Um, uh, please leave in the comments and... Um, on Imperium Theatre and on my channel what you want to hear next but uh, as always guys um, 
like a favorite the video, subscribe to my channel, subscribe to uh, Peer and Theater if you haven't already, and um, just watch um, my videos, please. So, um, anyway, guys, um, I hope you like the gameplay, I hope you like the story. This is really fun gameplay for me. Um, I'm playing with Jake, you know, it's quite fun to, like, play. I know we had another person in there. I don't know if he was a subscriber or just a fan of the channel, but um, he's called Uploaded Skills. You might see his game attack. I think he got a Reaper in this or something, or um, a Pavlo or something like that. But anyway, um, yeah, uh, just watch the video um, on my channel. Watch it on Imperium Theater. And um, just, uh, in general, just kind of um, support my channel. I know that I am... Um, I might not make the best videos in the world, but I think you do a pretty good job. So uh, anyway, guys, as I said before, this is getting too long now, but as I said before, like the video, subscribe, and peace out.